The greatest problem we face as a nation is the dramatic economic shift of our grandparents' generation to our children's generation. It is a loss of the ability to live on one income, own a home, and raise a family without debt. This is the destruction of the American dream. If you ask me who tweeted that, the last person on my mind would be Marjorie Tr Trashy Green. But it looks like 2022 was a year of surprises. I always get this twisted feeling in my gut whenever Republicans say or write anything remotely positive because more often than not, they're being disingenuous. And in this case, it's coming straight from the crooked fingers of living trash heap Marjorie Tetanus Green. Now we all know that MTG doesn't have the cleanest record on Twitter. She purposely got her personal account banned for clout by tweeting COVID disinformation. She's spoken out against green and renewable energy, which is 62% more affordable than the cheapest fossil fuel. And more recently remarked on how the greatest choice a woman can make is becoming a mother. Let me tell you what a woman's choice is, to be a mother. That is the greatest choice a woman can ever make. Which sounds like a line straight out of a 1950s men's magazine called How to Beat a Woman into Submission. Y'all, this is the same woman who said burgers were bud who, and who cannot pronounce petri dish. Because Bill Gates wants you to eat his fake meat that grows in a peach tree dish. So if you think for one minute that tweet about addressing income inequality was sincere, you'd be wrong. Marjorie Titan Green is an idiotic hypocrite. We all know her record. She, along with her Republican colleagues, voted against lowering gas prices and the price of prescription drugs. When Americans were experiencing a shortage in baby formula, they voted against funding to address it. You've made sure that Americans can barely access the ballot box to change things by failing to vote for democracy form measures. While over half a million people are homeless, 50,000 of them being veterans, Republicans wouldn't even let a bill that would allow funding to aid shelters leave the finance committee. So please, Marjorie, tell me how you care about income inequality. The truth is you don't. Be honest. You don't care about your constituents, about Americans, or the state of this country. You're a leech, constantly searching for your 15 minutes in a news cycle. You regurgitate disinformation and lies like your life depends on it. Nothing about your record shows you care about making life more affordable for working class Americans. You're a failure of a congresswoman and your legacy will be a mark of shame in the history books. I just don't understand how you wake up every morning thinking you're a useful part of the American government or anything for that matter. You literally don't add anything. You take. Take away the opportunity of useful legislation passing, take away attention from issues that matter, and now you've taken my time because I have to spend it calling you out. You're an embarrassment, and I hope you wake up one day and realize that. You need some serious self-reflection, Marjorie Titan Green. Thank you all for watching Rebel HQ. Like this video, subscribe to the channel, and have a great weekend.